a little bit too quick on the play. Couldn't really step into no, the pass, he did could not he? get into it. Second down for KCD. Atherton spent defenders crowding the line. Richter tossing it back. Gets it in the hands of Thomas. He's across the 50 and down to about the 45-yard line, halfway to a first down. Gary, in the first part of the ball game, Atherton was bringing both linebackers out of a six-man line and really forcing Country Day to get rid of the ball as we see the quick toss here to the outside. And now Atherton is backed off and they're playing those linebackers four and five yards deep and they're guarding against the pass play. I don't think they're going to get this play off as the horn has sounded. We're going to swap ends of the field as the Bearcats have one quarter left to come back in this ball game. But right now the home team in cruise control. Atherton 14 zip over the Bearcats as we approach the fourth quarter of first down touchdown coverage here on Insight. And let's see, make sure he doesn't go out of bounds. He's down that sideline. Breaks the tackle. Football. Nice pass. Good pass. Good concentration. Over the deep. Back to Beekman. And look at this cut right here. He was able to get in the end zone. Good blocking down on that. Now Smith spinning and still rolling out the middle. He may go all the way. Cheer. That's all he needs. Hi, I'm Coach Denny Crum. The Patriot game is terrific basketball between the Louisville police and firefighters. The fifth year for this event should be another exciting rematch. The game honors the heroes of 9-11 and our own local heroes. It also raises needed funds for the healing place, which serves Louisville's addicted and homeless. Tickets are only $10 at the door, and kids 17 and under get in free. So come on out to the game. 